Natsume. This I vow to you. I will love you forever. In this life and the next, I promise you. around meet you at the front
Jason! Protect the king! He's a black tongue, Jason. Stay here, Idas. Leave me! You men, go with the king!
wife to the next world. <laughs> Jason. It's over. Did I not do everything you asked of me? Why then? Here, of all places, on your sacred island, I do not accept it. If this is your will, I do not accept it. Jason, your uncle was looking for you. He wanted to know when you planned to give last rites to Alcime. If I send her spirit to the underworld, I'll never get her back. Get her back? Hmm. How? I don't know how. I don't have the answers yet. But there must be a way. I wish I had the answers to give you. But perhaps I know someone who could. Someone whose business is answers. The Oracle at Delphi. Delphi? If anyone would know, it would be her. Yes, the Oracle. Master Argos finishes a great ship as we speak. It will serve. Delphi is not easily found, it's said. Does he know the way? I don't know, but I aim to find out. Come, we'll ask him ourselves. Oh, remember, your uncle is ahead in the courtyard. He wanted to speak with Thano. This was his job. I told him I'd let you know. Sir, we'll have this garden looking better than ever. I promise you. Hera forbid I speak cruelly to that beautiful girl. And yet, the facts are gone. You'd have King Lycomedes ask Jason for his... King Jason, how can I express my sorrow? Thank you for your sympathy. My cousin and I were surprised to learn of the friendship between Hercules and yourself. How did you meet? Yolkus is a land sacred to Zeus, Hercules' father. Jason has been kind enough to offer his hospitality as the Warden of Zeus when I've come to visit. That's another thing. This Warden of Zeus. What does that title mean? All kings of Yolkus who complete the five trials of Zeus assume that title. 
In doing so, we swear to defend this land and the honor of Zeus against all threats. In some ways, it's a ceremonial title that reflects the strong attachment between Zeus and Yolkus. But what does the Warden do, exactly? The Warden of Zeus is charged with defending the island of Yolkus. We take a sacred oath to never leave this land once we pass our trials, and to be ever vigilant against any threat. In return, each Warden earns Zeus's protection. No Warden has ever fallen in battle on Yolkin soil. Fascinating! What else? Most of a Warden's time is spent training and preparing for situations we hope never arise. When a Warden has a son, he turns to his boy's training, preparing him for the trials he is to face. That training is the basis for a lifetime of dedicated practice and devotion. Such dedication! Is there anything else? The Warden is responsible for ensuring that the people of Yalkis receive justice. I often hear the cases of the people and offer judgment and arbitration. Another duty is to enforce the law and punish those who break it. A truly noble calling. Is there more? One of the Warden's most important duties is to perform a number of ceremonies in honor of Zeus. For example, the Warden performs the first sacrifice of the harvest season each year. As the god of hospitality, Zeus demands that we also care for any traveler who arrives on Yolkis. The Warden personally sees to the safety and well-being of those travelers. Your hospitality is second to none. Are there other duties? I'm sorry. I have some urgent matters to attend to. Perhaps we can speak of my duties some other time. Oh, I see. Of course. How can you be so cold? It's terrible. There you are, Jason. It's good to see you out of that mausoleum. It isn't healthy to linger over the dead, nephew. Yolkus needs its king. Captain Idas has finished his investigation. Petitions await, and we must set a date to give last rites to Alcime. There will be no date for that. What? Jason, I am your uncle, and I care for you. The will of the gods may be a mystery to us all, but to deny Alcime her last rites is unnatural. Until I'm certain there's no way to bring her back, I will not do it. Bring her back? Alcime is dead. You seek the impossible. Our legends speak of heroes who have done wondrous things. Things that would have been deemed impossible until they were done. And of those deeds, the greatest were done for love. I'm going to Delphi, Uncle. I'll find my answers there. This is the despair of grief. You're not thinking clearly. Alcime would not approve. Do not presume to say what she would think, Uncle. Alcime lies in the mausoleum behind me. I speak for her now. And I say she was a daughter of Ares. And if there is any way to bring her back, she would demand I find it. I understand your ardor, Jason. But have you thought this through? Delphi is not found on any map. Find a hundred charts, and each will point a different way. I would trust Argos's charts above any other. Hercules and I will go ask him ourselves. Very well. I know better than to argue with you when your mind is set. I will consult our records about the location of Delphi, in case Master Argos doesn't know the way. Thank you, Uncle. Delphi, I pray you find the answers you seek, nephew. I will go to the royal court and maintain some semblance of order there. I think they were sending a message to all of Greece. 